Guys, I don't have a lot of time. As you are watching this video, I am packing my very last belongings, which means I don't have a bunch of time to record videos. So I came up with the most big brain idea I've ever had, a one hour challenge. <laughs> I have never done this before. No other YouTuber has ever done this before. Such a good idea. I can't believe no one else has done this before. Like what's going on? Before we get into it, make sure to leave a like on this video as it really, really helps me out. If you're new here, consider subscribing. And if you want to support the channel and get the sounds that I use to produce, mhamusic.com. Let's do this thing, shall we? All right, uh, my phone is charging, so I can't show you the timer, but wait, maybe I can. One hour. Let's go. Let's go. Haven't figured out a melody, haven't figured out anything at all. I get really stressed out about these kind of things and I don't enjoy doing them. But here we are once again. <laughs> I'm gonna start off by opening Vital. Great free plugin. If you haven't uh, got it yet, it's, uh, it's, it's very useful. And I'll navigate to what happens to be one of the best sound banks in the world. MHA Vital Sound Bank. Link in the description. Since I'm very sort of still inspired by what I made earlier, the Clean Bandit uh, cover thing. I'm gonna start off with the Calm Bell 01. I'm gonna drag down the sustain and the release. So I get a shorter sound. And now we're gonna find some chords and a melody. Maybe something like this. Ooh, should we continue rising here? All right, I'm gonna make two alternative progressions. Progressions. Can't speak English, I'm Swedish. Nu kör vi det på svenska istället. Okej, jag kommer göra det här. Och sen så här. Vi slår det bra. Det här är helt fantastiskt. Imagine this channel being in Swedish instead. The problem with this chord progression is that it's so hard to develop from this. Like what happens here? The only thing is like. Da, da, da. That's like the only thing you can do, but we'll put some reverb on this and make it sound cool. That just livens up the whole thing, doesn't it? And some RC20. Holy crap, that sounds lovely. I'm just gonna drag in some vinyl crackle. This is also from the new sample pack. I will try my very best to release it in June. I want it to be perfect. Dude, that sounds so good, what the hell? The bell sound from the Vital Bank, that's gonna be my new thing, I think. And the RC20 just does that. It's like, it's perfect. Should we do the one with the flanger? Awesome. Let's do an ambient shot as well. The ambient shot 9 G sharp. I think he's one of my best friends in the entire world. Load a crap ton of uh, vintage verb on that. This vibe is so cool. I'm gonna put a bunch of reverb on the master. I'm gonna pull up an Edison. Just record this. And now we have this really beautiful reverse sweep. I'm just gonna take a crash transition as well from the new sample pack. Sorry guys, a lot of stuff from the new sample pack here. Little impact here. Two impacts. How about a little wind chimes transition as well? Also from the new sample pack. Again, sorry, sorry. You'll get your hands on it soon enough. I should probably work on the drop instead of this, but I just love breaks. Gonna open up another instance of Vital. I think like, <laughs> I love Vital so much. Let's do, I just want the, the simple uh, saw chords. I'm just gonna imagine that there's a build up here because I don't wanna spend too much time on it. And um, I'm just gonna make some drums real quick for the drop. I'm actually not using kick hard 2 this time. I'm using another kick that's very similar. 
but uh, that's also from the new sample pack. I feel like where Atmos lacks the most is in the kicks. That's why I just use the kick hard too, because it's like so good. So the kicks in the new sample pack are just so freaking nice and versatile. 20 minutes, 40 minutes to go. Easy. Okay, okay, we have to find a nice sound, a nice lead sound and a nice melody. I'm thinking we're gonna do something like a Don Diablo lead. I have this lead Diablo here. This could be cool. Imagine you're in the crowd. It's just Dude, that's actually a pretty nice melody. It's like super generic predictable, but whatever. It still touches you in here, you know? That's what matters. Whenever I hear this chord progression, I just uh, think of uh, Brazil Second Edit. Is that what it's called by Deadmau5? But yeah, this is sounding pretty cool. How much time do I have? Because this is all about prioritizing and time management. We have 30 minutes left. We have a basic structure. We have chords. We have a melody. It's all down to some producing now. Should be able to make this. Think, Melker. Think. Okay, I got it. We're creating a bass line. This one sounds like... It's like cyberpunky. It's like a little bit too low. Oh, that actually is... One... Ugh. Did you see that? I spit on my microphone. Did not mean to do that. Once I brought in the lead, it sounded... It doesn't sound too low anymore. God damn, this could be really cool. I, if I know myself correctly, I will freak something up. All right, we got a fat bass line though. What if I pitch this up? I think that's a better fit for the key that we're in. How much time? 20 minutes. Ouch, 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 ouch. The, I th I psh, I don't think I'm gonna finish this, but I, I have to try. All right, we'll add some white noise. I added two more bass layers from Serum. Now I'm gonna go into Vital. I'm gonna use one of my favorite basses. Bass first hit. New pattern, gonna layer the lead a little bit. Let's go with the Vital Bank again. Vital OP. I'm just gonna put like some random sounds together and we'll see what happens. Should we do chords first or should we do the little, uh, the little thing that I'm thinking about? 14 minutes left. Ambience is more important because it works without chords. I think just, I, I just want like a piano. And this just sort of acts as a background element. You know, some... Some, uh, ambience. So, should I work on filling out the drop, or should I continue on work like, making this a track? I think I'm just gonna have to put, like, a simple build-up loop here. Doesn't maybe necessarily fit in this sort of environment. I'm gonna put this ARP here in the drop as well. Alright, 10 minutes. I have a lot of stuff to do. So, some quick chords maybe? How much time? 6 minutes? If I nail the chords, if I find the right sound and I do it the right way, this can become awesome. So, it all depends on the chords, guys. Let's try the flanger chords. And I'm thinking I want to do some like... Uh, cut off, you know, LFO thing with this. If I can manage, if I have the time. One minute! I, I don't have time to do this. Wait, I have to restart the camera because it's about to die. Here we go. Yeah, no, there's no way. The freak. 
No! No! <laughs> it's so bad still. It's still so bad, guys. It's still so bad. But hey, I at least managed to do like a, a, an intro break, a build up and a drop in an hour with a nice melody, uh, some nice sounds, you know, it's I've done better in an hour and I've done I've definitely done worse. So yeah, let's check it out. Let's see the final result. I mean, yeah, there we go. I actually think it sounds pretty good for one hour, you know, considering again, intro, break, build up and a drop. That's pretty good in an hour, I must say. But yeah, I definitely might want to finish this. So let me know if you uh, want me to do that in the comments down below. Smash like on this video if you enjoyed, guys. Don't forget to join the Discord, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Spotify, all that good stuff down below. And if you're in the market for some new sample packs and sound banks, make sure to visit mhmusic.com. See you next Friday. Bye bye. <laughs>